hello guys so this is the 5.2 part because the uh, last time the streaming was stopped suddenly so uh, I'm just again live here and uh, in this session uh, I'm just going to crea create the camera follow script for our our heroes so I'm just going to show you what we have done in last uh, few parts so you can see we have a nice AI with uh, filia control or a floating dynamic joystick okay so you can see our character is working uh, same like the our heroes and here you can see we have uh, two enemies overlapping like this so Okay, and uh, now I'm going to play. You can also ask anything if you want in comment section, and uh, please do like if you like this tutorial or if you are following this series. Uh, you can ask any question or any doubt if you have in Unity. so you can see our uh, a player AI is working fine okay so now select uh, main camera and go to inspector and uh, now I'm going to create a new script camera follow open it in visual studio okay so Okay, so this is our camera follow script. So here we are going to take the reference for player controller. So player controller, player. Okay, and take the reference in start. So player is equal to find component type of player controller like this and then we create a new function public void cam follow like this and then we are going to create a new vector 3 here for target position and here we are going to create a new vector 3 like this and we are just going to uh, we are not going to follow the uh, player in the x-axis so we are going to take the reference for the transform dot position dot x means the camera x position and then we are also going to take the reference for camera's y position because we don't want to follow the player on y axis so transform dot position dot y and then we are going to take the reference for jet position for of player because we only want to follow the player on uh, jet axis so here it is okay like this and then terminate the line here okay like this and then we need to do the thing like transform dot position is equal to vector 3 dot larp and then put the first thing like uh, current position equal to target dot position and the second variable will be target position and pass one here 
okay and then we need to call this function in update just waiting for the script to be compiled and then hit the play button so you can see the our camera follow script is working quite fine and you can see if we are uh, moving in the horizontal so there is no follow uh, function and when we go up and down so camera will start follow us uh, this is the same feature like in uh, arc heroes okay so you can see the health bar is working fine in and in next part we will just uh, create the enemy AI and enemy movement script for uh, creating the more dynamic gameplay or the game mechanics uh, like this so yeah thank you for watching that tutorial and uh, yeah someone is uh, commenting is play back player is PC specs uh, I don't know what this means. Okay, so if you have any doubt, any question. Uh, please ask okay so you can see there are lots of other features which we need to be built in the in this uh, tutorial series we will also create a multiple weapon and the headshot function and the diagonal arrows and the uh, yeah the other power ups uh, that is already in the arc heroes in uh, yeah future parts so please stay tuned thank you so much for watching this tutorial thank you so much please uh, like this video and don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you